Welcome to English Talent Channel. Everyday Grammar. Describing your birthday. Recently, our subscriber wrote many lovely messages about their birthdays. We have been reading all of them. Most messages are happy. You wrote about gifts you received, the people who celebrated with you, or where and how you celebrated. Some messages seemed sad. Some of you do not get to celebrate your birthdays. Other messages were a mix of sad and happy. In this week's Everyday Grammar, we are looking at Jessica's message about her birthday. She wrote. A message from Jessica. My birthday was on last the 23rd of March. This was my 27th birthday. In my birthday no one wished me except my younger sister. And actually there was no device for this day. I spent my whole day as like it is a normal day. Sometimes I felt sad and sometimes I wasn't. Review of Jessica's message. Let us start at the beginning. Jessica writes. My birthday was on last the 23rd of March. We suggest changing this sentence to the present tense to say when your birthday is. My birthday is March 23rd. In American English, the usual order for dates is month, day, year. So instead of the 23rd of March, Americans usually say March 23rd. You use the past tense in this sentence. This was my 27th birthday. Another way we can say how old we are, is to use the past tense of the verb turn. I turned 27 this year. Here, turn means to reach or pass into a new age. Next Jessica wrote this. In my birthday no one wished me except my younger sister. We can change the word order of this sentence to make it clearer. Dot, no one wished me happy birthday, except my younger sister. Dot, instead of a prepositional phrase, in my birthday, we can just start the sentence with no one. No one is an indefinite pronoun meaning no person. You could also use the pronoun nobody. On to the next sentence and actually there was no device for this day. To devise is a verb meaning to plan or think up something. You were close. But in this sentence we need a noun. And we find it in the definition of devise, plan. Actually, there was no plan for the day. If you wanted to use the word devise, however, you could. It would come right after plan in the sentence. Actually, there was no plan devised for the day. Jessica's next sentence is. I spent my whole day as like it is a normal day. We should make a few changes to this sentence. As and like are both used to make comparisons between nouns. As is an adverb, and like is a preposition. We only need one of these to make the comparison. We can say I spent my whole day like it was a normal day. Let us look at Jessica's last sentence. Sometimes I felt sad and sometimes I wasn't apostrophe t. We suggest changing this sentence to sometimes I felt sad. But other times I did an apostrophe t. Now the two parts of the sentence agree in verb use. Also, we always capitalize the pronoun I in sentences. We use the conjunction but with other times only to create more contrast. It is also correct to write. Sometimes I felt sad and sometimes I didn't. Closing thoughts. Now, let's hear the revised message about Farana's birthday. My birthday is March 23rd. I turned 27 this year. No one wished me happy birthday except my younger sister. Actually, there was no plan for the day. I spent my whole day like it was a normal day. Sometimes I felt sad, but other times, I didn't. Thank you for Jessica for your message. We would like to wish you a happy birthday, early, for next year when you turn 28. We hope you enjoy the day.